The early 20th century witnessed the remarkable birth of electronics. Inventors and engineers brimming with new ideas eagerly sought ways to connect electrical components in increasingly sophisticated arrangements. This burgeoning field demanded a reliable and efficient method for building circuits. The answer, it seemed, lay in the development of the circuit board. Before the advent of printed circuit boards, circuits were painstakingly crafted by hand. Imagine a time before microchips and transistors, when bulky vacuum tubes were the heart of electronic devices. These early circuits were a testament to the ingenuity and patience of the pioneers who built them. The history of circuit boards is a fascinating journey from rudimentary connections to the intricate designs we see today. It is a story of innovation driven by the need for more compact, reliable and ultimately more powerful electronic devices. In the early days, constructing a circuit was a labour-intensive process. Engineers meticulously connected individual components using lengths of wire and solder. This method, known as point-to-point -point wiring, required a high level of skill and precision. Each wire had to be carefully cut, stripped and soldered to the correct terminal. Soldering irons, heated by flames or electrical resistance, were the tools of the trade. These early soldering irons, while functional, were often cumbersome and difficult to control. The solder itself, typically an alloy of lead and tin, was melted and used to create a conductive bond between wires and component leads. This meticulous process, while effective, had its drawbacks. Point-to-point -point wiring was time-consuming and prone to errors. A single misplaced wire or a poorly soldered joint could render an entire circuit inoperable. As circuits became more complex, the limitations of this method became increasingly apparent. Initially, circuits were built on bases as simple as wood. However, wood, with its inherent flaws and susceptibility to moisture, proved to be a less than ideal material for electronics. As the need for more robust and reliable circuit boards grew, engineers began experimenting with other materials. Bakelite, an early plastic, emerged as a promising alternative. This durable and insulating material quickly gained popularity in the burgeoning electronics industry. Metal, particularly aluminum, was also used in applications where its strength and heat dissipation properties were advantageous. The choice of substrate depended largely on the intended application of the circuit. Wood, with its low cost and ease of workability, was often used in simple devices. Bakelite, with its superior insulating properties, found its niche in radios and other consumer electronics. Metal, on the other hand, was often reserved for industrial and military applications where durability and heat resistance were paramount. Finding their footing, early applications of circuit boards. The first circuit boards, rudimentary as they were, played a crucial role in the development of early electronic devices. Radios, a marvel of the time, were among the first consumer products to incorporate this new technology. The military, quick to recognize the potential of electronics, used circuit boards in radar systems and other critical equipment during World War II. As the demand for electronics grew, so too did the need for more efficient and reliable circuit board manufacturing methods. Companies began to specialize in the production of circuit boards, supplying them to manufacturers of radios, televisions, and other electronic devices. These early circuit boards, while primitive by today's standards, represented a significant leap forward in electronics technology. They provided a more organized and reliable way to connect electronic components, paving the way for the development of increasingly complex and sophisticated devices. From rudimentary to revolutionary, the legacy of early circuit boards. The early pioneers of circuit board technology may not have envisioned the ubiquitous role their creations would play in the 21st century. From the smartphones in our pockets to the computers that power our world, circuit boards are the unseen foundations of our digital age. These early efforts, fueled by innovation and necessity, laid the groundwork for the printed circuit boards that would revolutionize electronics. The challenges they faced and the solutions they devised provided invaluable lessons for the engineers who would follow in their footsteps. The story of the circuit board is a testament to human ingenuity and our relentless pursuit of progress.
It is a journey that began with simple soldered connections and evolved into the intricate, miniaturized marvels of modern electronics. And it is a journey that continues to this day, driven by the same spirit of innovation that defined its earliest days. Hit that like button, subscribe and stay informed.